update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrials trading down 252, NASDAQ off 117, S&P's off 29. And yeah, you have some red there, but not like you had this morning, folks. If we take a look at the NASDAQ for futures first, this is pretty phenomenal, actually. But this is the type of market that you can expect here for the next uh, two or three months. We had the futures get down to 15,152. And the bottom line is that right at this particular point, you're 320 points off of those lows. You're down 105. And what this actually did, this is pretty wild. This actually went back to the breakout area of August 23rd. That's when we had broken topside. That number there was uh, 15,104. We got to 15,152. So we'll see what kind of a bounce we can get out of this thing. What I expect you're going to see is this. We're going to finish strong. I mean, it's been strong for the last two hours. You'll get a bounce, and the real question is how far we're going to get the bounce. But this, this market wants lower price. Uh, the futures want 14,366. And you can actually see how fast you can get there. We were down over five, 550, 600, 550. And uh, from where we were, down to that swing low would have only been another uh, 800. So bottom line, right now, we're bouncing higher. Gold. Gold contract rejected the 18, uh, 1789 out here this morning. You're at 1800 flat. Gold wants higher price. Bottom line, you know, we rejected a lower price out here Friday. You went against the strength on the, on the 17th of December. Bottom line, next leg. 1833, which is a swing high. The next one after that is 1881. And if we go to King Dollar, King Dollar is holding price out here. Uh, bottom line is that, you know, got hit Friday. You know, got today we got back up to 96,229. Right now you're at 95,990. It's about halfway move of the move of today. And this continues to be in a consolidation. We go over to the bond market. We take a look at the 10 year right now. 10 year note is trading. Down four ticks, flat, basically. Uh, you're at the lower end of the, of the, the curve of the consolidation. It broke the consolidation, uh, 128.22. You are yielding right now 1.79, I think. 1.77. Um, that's what you yield. And, in fact, that, that is the high for the, uh, it's probably the high for the year in the last three months. Stay right there, folks. Come right back to recap out here. We have the Dow Industrials trading. Down 270, NASDAQ off 122, S&P's off 32. Come right back.